Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be talking about the future of Star Wars together with some important um, news which came out yesterday, 4th of May. May the 4th be with you and what pieces of information do we have for you today. Um, some very important information and at the end of the video I will also be giving you an overview and a summary of uh, all the uh, Star Wars projects which will be coming out in a bit. So let's start with the video and let's get going. So piece of information number one, Taika Waititi will be directing the up coming uh, Star Wars movie. Uh, Taika Waititi, who is the filmmaker behind Thor Ragnarok and Jojo Rabbit, will direct and co-write the new uh, movie which will be coming out uh, in the cinemas and not on Disney+. Plus. Taika Waititi will be joined by 1917 writer Christy Wilson Cairns, who will write the script with Waititi himself. Uh, so far there is no release date available and uh, so far there is not a lot of information about the project however what do we know about it so far the previous date set for a star wars movie was december 16 2022 now this is according to hollywood reporter however since game of thrones creators david benioff and db vice dropped out from the project and as well as the coronavirus pandemic leading to massive issues for Hollywood in general it is most probable that this date will have to be moved forward what other information do we know about future Star Wars projects number one Mandalorian season 2 so Mandalorian season 2 will release on October 2020 it was created by John Favreau and stars Pedro Pascal and Gina Carano amongst others uh, loved and well known especially for the character of baby Yoda so Mandalorian season 2 will be coming out on October 2022 now uh, Project number two, Rogue One prequel. The prequel will follow the character of Cassian Andor. Uh, before the events in Rogue One, it is described as a spy thriller and will be debuting in 2021. So some other actors will be joining Diego Luna, include Alan Tudyk as the droid K2S0 and Stellan Skarsgård as well as Kyle Soller. And this information is according to Variety. Now, project number three, we've got an Obi-Wan Kenobi series, uh, which will start production in 2021. And this is with Ewan McGregor, who will return back to his titular role. The director for this series, this mini series actually, will be Deborah Chow, and it will be written by Jody Harold. Project number four. So, project number four is a new series, actually, which was confirmed by Disney and Lucasfilms. It will be a series with a female-led cast, as well as a female writer. It will be run by Leslie Hetland, who is a co-creator of the series Russian Doll. Finally, we've got some movies which I mean, have been confirmed by Lucasfilm and uh, Disney. However, there is not much information about them. Number one, we've got some movies by J.D. Dillard. Um, we've got also the Ryan Johnson trilogy. And obviously, we've got the mysterious Kevin Feige project, which we basically know nothing about. Now, um, about the future in general for Star Wars. So it is safe to say that the trilogy, that the trilogy was quite controversial. Uh, the sequel trilogy was extremely polarizing for the fans and it basically created a rift right between the fan base, uh, those who loved them and those who hated them. And obviously there were some like me who were in the middle. I didn't love them, but I didn't hate them either. I mean, uh, except for The Last Jedi maybe. <laughs> so this rift was somewhat healed by the Mandalorian season one, and I think it was almost, um, you know, ubiquitously loved by all Star Wars fans. Um, and one hopes that Disney and Lucasfilm understand why Star Wars is such a beloved film uh, series, right? We, I mean, we love Star Wars for the characters. Now, um, this is a long list, and one also hopes that 
uh, Disney and Lucasfilms will be focusing not just on quantity, but also on the quality, because we all know... It's about family, and that's what's so powerful about it. So, um, that's all for today, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, um, and stay tuned for the upcoming videos. Uh, please leave a like and a subscription if you enjoyed what you saw, and please leave a comment if you have a suggestion or any comment on the information I gave you. Uh, have a nice day, and hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.